I'm a huge fan of using YouTube in my language learning and also in my language teaching. And in this video, I'm gonna show you a couple of AI based technologies that I've discovered that are super simple, that are really powerful if you combine them with YouTube. This isn't complicated at all and it's gonna help you with things like your listening, your pronunciation, your vocabulary, your reading, particularly on extending your vocabulary as well. So let's start, two really quick tools, very simple to use, they're free and they combine with YouTube. One last thing, many people ask me how I make my videos. I use Camtasia, if you wanna try it out, there's a link to test it for free in the description. You can also buy it with a discount. I've provided a link there. And there's also a free six part course that will take you through everything in how Camtasia works. And I'll also put that in the description. So this is definitely my favorite technology for language learning at the moment. Basically it's called TurboScribe and it allows you to put the link from a YouTube video in. And what it will do very quickly is extract the whole text and also extract the audio file and therefore allow you very quickly to search for words that you don't understand in the video, etc. So you can see an example on the screen now. Now this one's in Polish because that's the language that I'm currently studying. And I've put the link in and it's generated for me this the complete text that I can copy and check in Google Translate or in another translation tool. But also, I've actually got the audio file. It actually extracts the audio file from the YouTube video and allows you to play that. Now, this opens up so many different ways of now studying that video. And let me just show you a few examples. So that means I can now listen and read at the same time. So if I click here. Na pewno znacie ten moment, kiedy jesteście na rozmowie kwalifikacyjnej i pytają was, ile chcielibyście zarabiać. A wy nie macie pojęcia. Now what else I also like is as well as reading out the, the text for you, it also highlights exactly what is being read out. I can even control the speed. So if it's a little bit too fast for me, and that sometimes happens, I can slow the pace down. This really helps me when I want to listen and read at the same time. Remember, this has extracted the text and the audio from a YouTube video. And of course, I'm going to show you how to do that in a minute. Now, another great thing is that it allows me to really quickly search for any vocabulary that I don't understand. Let me show you how. Now, obviously, this can be in any language. As I said, I'm studying Polish, but this could be in English, in French. It will extract whatever text you provide it with. And let's say, for example, I didn't understand this phrase here. What I can just really easily do then is just copy that phrase very quickly, jump over to Google Translate or any kind of uh, translation software that you like using, paste it in and get the immediate translation. Now, one really nice thing in Google Translate is that you can actually save all the sentences that you want to study. You can click on this button here and it saves them to your word book. Now, if you want to open up your word book, what you do is you click here and you can see actually that I've been doing it today and these are all the sentences currently that I need to study. And you can actually go through your workbook and play the sentences. Zapytamy tutaj ludzi. Więc wydaje mi się całkiem, całkiem sensownie. So this is really, really useful. Now, let me just show you a few more of the things that you can do and also show you how you actually put the video into the system and it extracts it. And as I said, it does it very quickly. So let me just take you through an example here. So I've got an English example this time, but as I said, it could be in French, it could be in Spanish, it could be in Polish, it could be in German, etc. I'm just going to copy this link as simple as that. It doesn't matter whether the video has got subtitles, that's nothing to do with it because it extracts the subtitles from the voice. And all you need to do, and I'm just going to click here on TurboScribe, is to go to Transcribe Files, very simple, click here, and then add in your link and then click on import. So the first thing that it's gonna do is just import in that video. And then the second thing you're gonna to need to do is to set it once it's imported in that video to actually transcribe it. So let's just wait a few seconds. Okay, so it's now been imported and it's now time to transcribe it. I'm gonna choose the language. Now obviously I'm not gonna use Polish. I want this one to be English and I'm gonna choose the level of transcription. I'm gonna use Dolphin, which is balanced. Now, just to explain, if you've got a video that's got lots of background noise, 
and you really want to make sure that you extract the text correctly you can choose more accurate dolphin seems to work fine for me there are a couple of other settings but i'm not interested in those i'm just going to simply click on transcribe and off it goes it is now going to transcribe and extract the text and extract the audio so that i can then work with it and this is so so powerful okay i can now see that it's all done and if i click here you'll now see that i've got the complete text and i could even come over to the right hand side here and even download the audio file i can play with the audio file here obviously you need to turn the volume up and remember you can even slow it down so let's just click and just see how good this is hi i'm vanessa from speakenglishwithvanessa.com would you like to go grocery shopping with me let's do it absolutely fantastic and again of course what i can now do is just copy any words that i want to pick up from here for example let's say i didn't understand what that meant i could just copy that of course copy jump over to google translate or of course any other translation tool and get the translation so this is a really quick way of me kind of really understanding and working with a uh, audio file of course that comes from the video really quick break from the video just a few seconds if you like what you see and you want more free videos please come over to teachertrainingvideos.com there's a menu system along the top that you can make use of but if you scroll down on the first page you'll see lots and lots of videos i specialize in the use of technology for both teachers and students in the domain of language learning now if you really want to follow what i do the best thing to do is to sign up to the newsletter if you sign up to the newsletter you get updated with all the latest videos you also get updated on the webinars that we run and they're often free just like the one that you can see on the screen now and also the blog posts and the courses that i run but most interestingly at the moment if you sign up you get a free 14 part video course where i basically highlight the most popular technologies on my website and on my youtube channel that teachers and students have commented on and there's about 14 videos in total and nearly everything that i recommend is free right let's get back to the video now I think this next technology is brilliant for those tricky words. So if you've got a word that you're really struggling to understand what it means, you can put it into this system, it's called youglish.com, and it will give you lots and lots of examples from YouTube of how that word is used. So you can see the word in the video, you can read the word, you can see it in context, and you can even copy the word and put it into Google Translate, which is exactly what I do. So let me give you an example of this in action. So I'm on Youglish, we're gonna choose English, and notice that it works in multiple languages again, lots of different languages, but I'm gonna work in English. In fact, what we can do is let's take a word from here that let's say there's a word that we're really struggling with. Let's use the word expression. So I'm gonna just copy that word. This is exactly what I do, okay? So I copy the word, any words that I'm really struggling with, I wanna see examples. I'm gonna just paste that into Youglish, make sure I've chosen English. I click on say it and it immediately it finds for me in literally seconds 9,866 examples of the word expressions being used in different YouTube videos. Now the interesting thing is I can now listen and play through those videos. If I click here, let's just go to the next one. Um, and what are nonverbal expressions of power and dominance? Well, let's go to the next one. The original expressions, of course, are for all intents and purposes. Let's go to the next one. The two women are almost caricatures. And let me just pause a minute. If there's a sentence that you think, oh yeah, that's really a good example. I want to keep that one. That's really helping me to understand what the word means. You can copy that sentence just as you did from TurboScribe. Jump over to Google Translate. Let's imagine, for example, that I'm studying English, but I'm a Spanish person. I could paste that word in get the translation into Spanish, and then of course save it in my word book. And so you might then go to another sentence. It can be cold. And do exactly the same thing. So you think, yeah, I wanna save that sentence because it's a really good example. So you copy it, you come over to Google Translate, you've already saved that one, so you can just delete it now. Put in the new word or the new expression, 
and then again add it in okay I copied that a little bit wrong actually just gonna make sure that when you copy you only copy the sentence and nothing else okay so let me just copy that and do that again just come back delete that and let's paste it in to do it correctly and then again add it into my uh, word book this is for me so useful and again youglish is free and of course it's working with the content from youtube really glad that you stayed to the end of the video and don't forget what i mentioned if you sign up to the newsletter on teachertrainingvideos.com there is a 14 part course it's completely free there are no tricks uh, in using technology in teaching and learning and nearly everything that i recommend is free if you do want to contact me about doing some training with you, perhaps with your institution, you can contact me from the website. I run workshops, I do lots of conferences. I sometimes even do one-to-one -one training on very specialized technologies like Zoom and Camtasia. Finally, if you'd like to have live training with me, uh, then you can join me on Patreon. For just $6 a month, you get the chance to meet me online with the rest of the Patreon group. We normally look in detail at a particular technology and then we do activities with it so that we learn it really well. And I often show the teachers things that they don't realize about these technologies. And apart from that, I also add up videos onto Patreon that I don't use or don't add on to my YouTube channel. These are often technologies that I've not covered on YouTube or I go into more detail. So for example, you can see here on the screen now several videos that I've uploaded and we haven't covered these aspects on uh, YouTube. So if you're interested in that live training with me plus extra content that I put onto Patreon, the cost is $6 a month, then please join me. I'd love to see you on Patreon as well. I'm gonna leave some more videos on the screen now that you might find useful.